Hello, I am Nimja, and this is Terrible Teasing Tactics. This file might hypnotize you, who knows what will happen, but it should be quite enjoyable to listen to because who doesn't like a bit of teasing every now and then? Unfortunately, this isn't a little bit of teasing. This is terrible teasing. You know when you get in one of those moods where you just want to tease people? One of those moods where you feel bratty and playful and all you can do is think about ways to mm, get people out of their groove. You don't want to hurt them, you don't want to actually be mean. You just want to sort of interrupt their standard patterns and bring a little bit of variation to their life. See, you're a good Samaritan. All you want to do is just bring a little bit of variation, surprise, something new into their life. See, maybe I'm going to hypnotize you and maybe I won't. Maybe I'm just tempting you with hypnosis and maybe I'm actually bringing you deeper and deeper as we speak. Who knows? Well, I do, of course, and you do too once you've listened, or maybe I won't even let you remember. Wouldn't that be fun? So that listening to this file every time again will be a surprise. Or maybe it won't. Maybe I'll make you remember on purpose, but just let you feel how helpless you are when I manipulate you. Or just teasing. Hmm, who knows anymore? Well, perhaps you do, or perhaps you will. Are you already hypnotized because you're listening to my words and you're used to my voice? Or maybe all of this is new. Maybe the heaviness of your eyelids is just a side effect of my boring voice, droning on and on about useless and pointless things, while your eyes just get heavier and heavier and all oh, this gets so predictable. But maybe it works. Maybe this predictable teasing works. And do you want to work with me? Do you want to enjoy the feeling of being terribly teasing? Do you want to follow my tactics along as I tease you back and forth? And how about you? Are you going to take me serious? Are you going to giggle and try to throw me off? Do you want to make me stumble over my words as you giggle to the things I say? Shaking your head, thinking, no, I won't get hypnotized. You don't have any power over me. But maybe I do. Sticking out your tongue won't help either. All that matters is that you listen. And, you know, bar taking off your headphones or turning this off, you're still listening. So you're letting my voice sneak into your mind, letting my words sneak past your ears into your head, past your eyes, and slowly tugging on your eyelids from the back, making them heavier and heavier, just like I said before, but now different in a different way. It worked, but it shouldn't work. This is just playful and silly. Why would it work? Why would your eyelids start feeling heavier just because I tease? Maybe you like the tease. Maybe you think my terrible teasing tactics are absolutely alluring and adorable. Who knows? Well, I can't abide by all this alliteration all the time, so I'll just continue. I'll just continue teasing you terribly. And of course, you will remember, unless you don't. You can't remember what you didn't say and you're not the one talking, you're just listening. You're just listening, smiling, giggling as your eyes are slowly closing and getting heavier. Just tiny little slits. Oh, well, not anymore of course, now you're aware and you're trying to open them. But they were slits just now. Your eyes were just nice and heavy as you were listening. Hmm. Maybe I should confuse you more, or should I tell it to you straight? Of course, all these words are not straight at all, they're sort of curving along the subject, circling like a moon around the planets. And yet, 
there is a purpose, there is a pattern, there is a path. Even the moons and the stars all follow patterns, all follow paths. They just circle around each other influenced by the most subtle of things. And so do my words. They circle around you, passing you by again and again and again until your eyes become so heavy of watching me pass that they can't possibly stay open. And similarly for your mind, every time I pass around, every time I remind you of how heavy your eyes become, you open them again, surprised at how heavy they became just before I said it. Or maybe they became heavy because I said it, and you just became aware a few seconds later. Or maybe you didn't. Maybe you just forgot that you did. That's okay. Are you already hypnotized or am I just playing? Are you listening mindlessly with just some faded expressions on your face? Or is your face as expressive as ever? Hmm. I think my words are having more effect than you think. My words are just flowing through your mind back and forth, bouncing from one side to the other, echoing while I continue to talk, echoing while you continue to listen, trying to follow my words and trying to listen to my words deeper and deeper. And the more you listen, the more you let them influence you. The more you listen, it's like you're reading them in your mind. It's like you're reading them on a textbook inside your mind as you're trying to transcribe the words that I'm saying. And you manage, in a sense, you manage to follow along just perfectly fine. You manage to follow along with my words as I pull you deeper into trance just fine. See, your face has been getting softer this whole time. Your mind has been getting softer this whole time. And it's just a little bit of terrible teasing tactics. Just some playful words flowing across your mind, making you smile and then sink deeper. See, after every smile, there's this moment of relaxation, this short window of vulnerability as I tease you into terrible, terrible trance. See, there are different meanings of the word terrible. You can use it in a sarcastic manner, but also in a playful one, where you secretly enjoy something so much that you don't want to admit it, just like you're enjoying this moment much more than you want to admit it. That's okay though. You can still stick out your tongue as much as you want. I know what's really happening in your mind. I know what you're really feeling. And I know how much you like being terribly teased into submission. Terribly teased into that warm feeling where you're hoping I'll just snap my fingers and make you drop. But I didn't yet. I'm just teasing. I'm delaying the inevitable and playing with your mind. I'm flowing across your face, your mind, your eyes, going deeper and heavier more and more. But I'm just teasing. Do you want to work with me or against me? Do you want to be hypnotized deep inside or do you want to stay awake? Well, I know what you want deep inside, but do you let yourself feel it? They let yourself enjoy it. You know you were bound to lose as soon as you started listening to this file. But that's okay. You know you wanted to lose. You know you wanted to surrender. But... Hmm. It's not yet time. You've been floating for a while. You've been drifting for a while. Maybe you are already in trance. Maybe you've already let yourself go. But who knows, who will remember? Will I remember what you did? Will you remember what I did? You can't remember what you didn't say. You can't remember what you didn't do. 
But if you did fall in trance, would you remember, would you just forget to remember to forget? It's fun to remember to forget, isn't it? It's a contradiction that helps you to forget to remember, and yet you remember to forget. So listen to me as I bring you deeper and deeper into that wonderful state of trance where you just listen and not let yourself think at all. There are just so many words, so many ways to pull you deep, and this is just one of them. Just a playful way of distracting you and at the same time pulling you further and further. And all I have to do is snap my fingers and tell you to do one thing. You're so ready right now, you're so ready to listen, you want me to do it. But I don't do it just yet. I'm playing, I'm teasing. I'm using terribly teasing tactics, aren't I? And you're enjoying it. You're having fun with the moment. Because even though I use words like lose or win, this is not a contest. See, the only thing you lose is your grip on reality for a moment. And what you win is a wonderful peace of mind. A delicious feeling of trance for just a few moments. So you both win and lose, and so do I. See, I lose my chance at teasing more, because as soon as the game is over, even though I've won, I've also lost my opportunity to tease more. Because once you've dropped deep, how can I still tease you? Hmm. <laughs> Although I'll probably find a way. I've been known to be terribly teasing. As I've hopefully proven already so far. But do you think we're done? Oh no. Oh, not at all. I know you want me to snap my fingers and just let you drop. But no. Not yet. I'm just enjoying bouncing your mind up and down. As if you're going around a deep spiral closer and closer to the middle, but never quite getting there. Stuck in orbit. Swerving around the sun. Feeling a moon circle around you. And yet, you're still sitting still. Feeling deliciously drifty and just so floaty. So wonderfully floaty. Just letting yourself slip into that state of not really having to think and embracing that you don't have to. Let yourself think of it as winning wonderfully, as enjoying the feeling of going deep, as embracing that moment where you simply drop. Dropping so deep. That wonderful moment where everything just clicks into place. And in a way, all this wonderful, terrible teasing has helped you to relax, to open up. It has helped you to feel better and embrace the moment in a very playful and welcoming way. So it's nice to go deeper now. It's so good to let yourself drift deeper. Are you already hypnotized or am I just playing? Perhaps you are, perhaps I'm not. Perhaps we both are playing and yet the game is so much fun that you can't help but drop deeper. The game is so wonderfully fun that you want yourself to just let go and embrace the moment into wonderful emptiness. A moment of delicious emptiness, where your mind drops and forgets to think, and thinks only to forget. My words can be a guide. A shining beacon of blissful ignorance as you navigate through the trance and follow my voice guiding you deeper and deeper. 
Your mind is a little bit like an impossible landscape, but it's very easy to navigate once you follow a single direction. And once you have that single direction in mind, your mind will be singularly focused. Focused on my voice and only my voice and everything else fades away. And that moment when I tell you to drop becomes ever more powerful. It pulls you in deeper and deeper. And you will remember to forget. Letting yourself enjoy this moment. Playful. Teasing. Confusing. It'd be very difficult to remember all the words, wouldn't it? So it's not about remembering the words. It's about remembering the sensation, the feeling, the teasing and the enticement. And in a moment, this file is going to end. And when it ends, if you hear me again, you'll just stay nice and deep. And otherwise, you'll awaken slowly but comfortably. Perhaps slightly confused and somewhat teased, but that's okay. I'm sure you'll enjoy it and remember it fondly, even if you don't quite know what you remember. Hmm. So for now, enjoy and don't forget to drop and listen.